flooding brought on by Sandy's wind and rain, and the storm surge, the waves that were created along the coast. And sometimes, many found themselves homeless in New York City. Yet hope found its way in the most unexpected part of the world, with caring people of the Filipino community through the partnership of Iglesia Ni Cristo and the FYM Foundation. Our correspondent, Gabby Borromeo, is on the scene reporting on this extraordinary monumental event. Hi everyone, I'm your host Gabby Borromeo with OTSNY. Here we are in New York City in Times Square where we are with the FYM Foundation where they are providing aid for homeless people here in New York City. You know, this is actually the first time a third world country is providing aid for a first world country. So we are witnessing history and as you can see, the turnout is amazing. So follow me where I'm going to interview some of the people. The overwhelming turnout exceeded expectations when thousands gathered together in Times Square to receive gift bags from enthusiastic Filipino INC member volunteers. Here we are with the gift bags that they're giving away for the homeless and the underprivileged. I just saw a bunch of homeless people coming through to, you know, to watch the show and I just started crying because you know what, these are my people. You know, coming from all around the world, helping people. This is, this is humanity at its best and I'm so proud to call myself a Filipino today. I mean, as you can see, there's so many people and look at the gift bags. They have food in there, they have gift cards. The, the kids get $35 to Toys R Us. You know what we take for granted? Um, these kids, they're going to enjoy it so much and they're going to Toys R Us actually afterwards to give the kids toys and it's a pretty momentous moment here today in New York City. Here you are with Carissa, how are you today? I'm good. Where are you from? I'm from Virginia Beach. Okay, so what brought you out here today? Um, helping the people who were victims of Hurricane Sandy. So how does it feel to help the homeless and underprivileged today? It feels great. Here we are with Rosa and her beautiful daughter. So tell me, how do you feel about the organization? Yo me siento bien ahora porque están dando una donación. Me siento feliz. Gracias. Here we are with Carlos. So tell me, how do you feel about the organization? Um, the, this org is so nice. They're nice to us. They give us food. They got. They gave us a free road trip. They nice. They very nice people. You know, I could. I can say anything about them. I like. They're very nice. Thank you so much. They just started handing out the well-needed donation bags to the people in need here in New York City. From the FYM Foundation, participated in helping to give gift bags as well. Giving the gifts was a joyful experience for both those who helped the distribution and those who received the gifts. Here we are with Angel. How are you today? I'm fine from the Bronx. Great, happy to be here. He just received a donation bag, so he's going to show us what they received today. Can we see it? Let's see what kind of love is in the bag, baby. We got uh, oh, brochures, you know, literatures, definitely. A blanket. A blanket. Oh, what's Toilet it trying to say? Paper. Toilet paper. Toiletries. Look. Toiletries. Water. Uh, socks. Water. And these are some probably some gift, gift cards. cards. Yeah. So, what do you want to say to FYM Foundation? Thank you very much. I could use it, and you'll have a good day. Peace. Thank you so much, Angel. I hope you guys enjoyed this segment here with the FYM Foundation in Times Square. This is a day in history that we are all witnessing, and we're very lucky today. I'm your host, Gabby Borromeo. Thanks for watching OTSNY. <laughs>